All right, changing gears now, New Orleans leaders say they have enough interest from outside police agencies to host a full Mardi Gras season this year. Yeah, they are coming in to help secure the city's parade route. So Paul Murphy joining us now on who's coming so far and Paul, who's not? Well, Sharice, Katie, the cooperative agreements for the outside police departments and sheriff's offices to sign didn't go out until last Friday. And right now, some departments are still deciding whether to send officers Others in Greater New Orleans are already saying no. New Orleans Mayor Latoya Cantrell said in a briefing last week the city's call for law enforcement help from across the state was a success and Mardi Gras crews can return to their traditional parade routes. Generette, for example. Wow. You know, um, of course, you know, tangible, tangible whole. Wow. You know, and of course, our partners, Baton Rouge and even um, Jefferson Parish. But we're just seeing a, a reach that's deep. We checked with local sheriff's offices and learned St. Charles, St. John, St. Tammany, St. Bernard, Jefferson, Plaquemines and East Baton Rouge parishes have all said no to the parade details. In the New Orleans area, only the Tangipahoe Sheriff's Office is still considering the request. The Orleans Sheriff's Office is expected to provide about 75 to 100 deputies on a given night. The Orleans Constables and the Xavier and Holy Cross University Police Departments are expected to help out as well. We are going to try to afford to give them at least four to six officers to work those parades uh, consistently throughout the remainder of the 23 se uh, season. The Generet City Marshal in Iberia Parish is also sending six to ten deputies. Marshal Furness Martin called the opportunity to help New Orleans during Carnival a no-brainer. I personally have attended the Mardi Gras uh, at times in the past and, you know, enjoyed myself, but uh, when we saw that they were, you know, lacking the manpower, we've been in that position. When when agencies need the manpower, you know, that, that's just that brotherly love within law enforcement, you know. Chief Marshal Pierce at Holy Cross says he expects his officers to blend in well with the NOPD and other agencies protecting the parade routes. We're a small agency, but yet we have a big heart, and our goal is, and part of our mission is to be a part of uh, helping out in the city of New Orleans as needed. And we have also learned that police departments from West Wego, Gretna, Kenner and Slidell have also declined to work those New Orleans parade details along with the Harbor and Levee District Police Departments. We're live downtown. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News.